Somewhere in the depths of Stony Cove, 10 miles from Leicester, there was treasure, a whole chest full. So 25 teams of four came from all over the Midlands, prepared to stay below till they found it. The similar hunts were held at Ullswater and Swanage. Everybody taking part was a member of the British Subaqua Club. Competitors were told that the chest was to be found at about 30 feet underwater at a given bearing from the starting place. This was the first treasure hunt of its kind and it shows the popularity of skin diving that there was such a good turnout. In the swim, but definitely not a diver. This lake is so deep in parts that the bed has never been completely charted. Naturally, the chest eluded the searchers for a long time. It was well worth the effort, as there was a prize of a hundred guineas for the team locating it, and it's good sport anyway. But at last up came the treasure, a Matlock team bringing it to the surface. They were entitled to 70 guineas, the rest going to the second and third prize winners. What excitement when the chest was unlocked. It was found to contain a lot of half-crowns and a scroll from Jamaica, that romantic land of pirates' treasure, commanding that the finder be awarded 100 guineas. All good, wet fun.